uh, welcome to another video. I'm still in my shirt. This is my shirt. I am on a roll today. I just, I think after so long of not filming, I am just ready to jump into filming every video that I can think of. My brain is just rattling. <laughs> Sorry. Sorry, I had a red, I had a monster at 4.30 this morning, and then a Mountain Dew at 6 o'clock this morning, and now I'm ready. Anyway, I am going to be doing a long-awaited Ipsy unboxing. It's not, well, unzipping, because I don't have the thing anymore, and even then, it's not a box, it's an envelope, but I have not done one of these in a while. I actually, I don't even know if I've been getting Ipsy bags, that's so bad. For the past two months, I honestly can't remember if I've even been getting Ipsy bags. Somebody's been just taking them out of the mail for me, or if I've even paid for them, I I really I don't know. But, um, yeah, this has a really... You see me scratching that? Excuse my nail polish. I tried painting them, and then I just didn't want that color anymore, and I started chipping it off. But I only painted one hand. But, yeah, this bag is really cute. It's a... I wouldn't say gold, maybe a copper, burnt copper, burnt copper. So first item in my Ipsy bag is Ipsy NYX. It is a shadow palette, three tones, let's see, does it say the color? Three color shadow palette, um, it does not say what colors. So we're just going to open this, this is a cute little packaging. It is actually kind of like my Paris one. I'm loving these NYX palettes with <laughs> these little bow opens. This is really cute. You guys are doing a good job. Keep it up. I actually had problems opening this when, um, when I first got it. But the colors in here are beautiful. So if you can see these guys, my skin's as a lighter ashy color. The middle brown one disappeared almost in my skin, so this would probably be a really great transition color for in my creases. And this black is just your standard black. It's actually kind of less of a complete black and more of a ash gray. Or at least that's kind of how it came off on me. So yeah, I definitely like this one. I will give Ipsy a plus for that. Next is the City Color City. Oh, I said that right. Hmm. City Color City Chic Lipstick in the color One Night Stand. Mm. Never had one of those before. I'm not. I'm not being sarcastic. <laughs> that was not my sarcasm in its finest. Um. Let's see. Let's. See. Ooh. This is a pretty color. This is nice. I. I like this. I don't, uh, I can, I can, ooh. So, first, first impression, first of all, love this color. Um, I'm definitely probably going to wear this tomorrow. I love this color. It goes on very smooth. It is not really, it's, a, it's very creamy. It's a nice little creamy formula. It's not too matte like I do prefer for some odd reason, but it is very nice. City Chic Color. Why do I feel like I've heard of City Color? Why do I feel like I have something of them? Or maybe somebody bought me something. I don't know. But I do love this. Alright. Here is another shadow. Oh, no. No, no, no. Many Brow Trio Shades of Brow. So this is a eyebrow. Okay, this is perfect for on the go again. Because I have been trying to carry my makeup my full size and all my makeup bags and it's not working it's not working at all um just a standard little trio palette uh let me it's sunlight man it's pretty standard uh the phoenix when you need to rise from the ashes yet again revitalizing hand slash body lotion from not so what what radio not so let's see Oh, that smells really good. It's persimmon, I can't say that word, plus plum. It actually smells really good. And my hands have been getting dry a lot at work because I wash my hands a lot. There we go. Let's see. Okay, it's not it's not too thick. I kind of like thicker lotions because they kind of just they sit on your skin a little bit, 
But then, like, when they absorb in, you can feel how soft your hands are going to be. Okay, let's... I don't think I got any on the back of my hands. And that's how I tell my lotions are good or not. If they go on the back of my hands, nice. Eh. I would say this one's probably a miss for me. It's just a regular little lotion. It's not very softening, revitalization. I mean, my hands don't feel super soft. I like some of the lotions I already have. So, eh, not too impressed with that one. And last but not least, something I've already actually tried and I'm very impressed with. I love, I love, I love, I love, I love, I love. It is the Glam Glow Flash Mud Brightening Treatment. This, first of all, smells amazing. I, uh, smells like apples and fresh water and, wait, I'm smelling my lotion now. <laughs> Yeah, this smells amazing. It smells like apples and berries and like fresh water. This works amazing. I actually use it for my under eyes for to help brighten them up, especially when I'm not feeling like I got enough sleep. Um, I've used this twice already. This is definitely a grab. I love this, and I'm actually thinking about going to buy the full jar. I think it's like $46 or so. I don't know. Um, if you guys like the video, please leave a comment down below and let me know what you think. And yeah, that's it. I'll see you guys next week. Bye. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I know it was a little long, but doing some of these unboxing videos, especially for Ipsy bags, do tend to take a while. Um, I have noticed that my Vidmas videos have been posting up very late this week. And I am working, you guys, on getting that fixed for next week. So hopefully I'll have a time frame or a time that I will be posting. And I will post that on the blog as well as on the Facebook group. I gotta hope you guys enjoyed this video. And I will see you in tomorrow's Vidmas video. Goodbye.